what up dokoners hint number three has just released on global dokon's twitter so obviously jp is going to be retweeting it let's take a look at the three hints now in consecutive order and uh, we will then discuss what this could mean because with the new hint comes some new updates so here we go here's the first one oh my god okay number one number two And number three. Oh my gosh, do you see that? What is that? <laughs> what? Oh my gosh. Oh, wait. There it is again. Oh. Is that SoCal? So, yeah. Um, we kind of got somewhere in part two, right? Because we saw this... It was not moving. Then there was some lightning. So that kind of gave us that, you know how I've been saying, you get one other crucial element and it kind of gives you more pieces to the puzzle, right? Initially, it was just something flying in the sky, which opened up the possibilities to a number of different things. Weiss and Beerus, Saiyan pods, a person, Nimbus, all sorts of things, Dragon Balls. And now with the second video, well, not now, but yesterday with the second video, that gave us something new. What does it look like when it's not moving? Well, that gave us a lot of Broly vibes, but now we've seemingly regressed back to it just it flying around again. So, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I will say. Oh my gosh, do you see that? What is that? Oh my God. <laughs> what? Oh my God. I'm pretty sure this is like my neck of the woods. This looks like SoCal. Even the license plates are like white colorish. This. This might be like Pasadena or something. Am I crazy? Gosh. Oh my God. There it is again. Oh. Is that Capital One? Wait. That's Capital One, right? My mind's playing tricks on me. I'm pretty sure this is like Pasadena. There it is again. Oh. Okay. So yeah, we haven't, we don't really get anywhere with this one. Now I'm not here to complain. Um, I will say though, that in terms of what I liked about the hints is that it gave us something more each time. I'm not really feeling that with this one. I might be missing something. So, you know, check the pinned comment if there's anything that I want to add or if there's something that you guys mentioned down below that might be of significance, then feel free to chime in. But this really doesn't give us anything more. Instead, it kind of just reopens the, the argument for a Nimbus, I think, honestly. Mainly because of the angle that it's moving in. It really seems like it's a lot lower than it was before. I don't know. Uh, another thing that people mentioned in the last video was these could be Dragon Balls, which I suppose it is possible. But now that we've seen a third video, we have now seen nine shots. So we've seen nine uh, instances of a flying object, which doesn't work with a Dragon Ball, right? Like if we were to count each one of these as a singular Dragon Ball, there's one. There's two, there's three, right? There's seven Dragon Balls total. So those are three. And then here we get four, five. I mean, that would be six, right? What else would that be? So there's six. And then we've got seven, we've got eight, we've got nine. So I guess if anything can be taken away from this, it's that it's not a Dragon Ball, but I still think that the Dragon Ball saga is in play. Now, the reason why I am now kind of leaning more towards Nimbus is, again, because of the, the angles. They're kind of showing it at different angles. And um, actually, you know what? For this one, all of the shots were in the daytime. I don't know, man. I just don't know. So I'm going to leave this to you guys to really speculate. Uh, I mean, we already know how I feel about a Broly celebration. I think that that would be cool. But let me be clear. I would be totally on board with a Dragon Ball Saga. Also, I got one comment thinking that I'm now suddenly pretending like I called this. I didn't, dummy. All right, I never called this. I never called Dragon Ball Saga. I never called Saiyan Saga. I never called Broly. I have been wanting Tournament of Power. So I am wrong no matter what. So if anybody seems to think that I am now suddenly championing this movement, I'm not. 
I, I never ever called this. I did say Saiyan Saga after I said, all right, I guess I'm not gonna get what I want. So let me throw something else out there, Saiyan Saga, but I don't claim it. So yeah, let me know what you guys think about this. I guess if anything, let's try to put together a potential Dragon Ball Saga theme celebration for this video. I don't really know where to go. I mean, look, Kid Goku would be the first one. Demon King Piccolo would be the second one. I will say though, in my other video that I talked about like the the adventure of Piccolo or like the, the journey of Piccolo, I think that would be a very cool central theme. They have been kind of getting a little bit more nuanced with their with their themes. So instead of it just straight up being Dragon Ball Saga, I would actually totally be fine with them kind of framing this from the perspective of Piccolo. Piccolo's journey from, you know, terror of Earth to one of the greatest heroes, right? So what would a what would a part one, part two look like? Well, for part one, let's say it is an int Dokkan Festival LR Goku Youth. Nah, you know what? Nah. Piccolo. We'll make Piccolo the big bad boss. Actually, wait, isn't he a big bad boss? Well, we'll get to that. Um, so Carnival, I don't know, Tech, Tech LR, Kid Goku, right here. Okay. And that'll be the Kid Goku that's standing in front of TN all angry and serious as he's facing off against DKP. And then for Piccolo, let's see here. We don't have a lot to choose from. Is this a big bad boss? He's not a big bad boss. Are any of them big bad bosses? I can't remember. I never use these guys, so I don't remember. No, that's always been one downside about the Piccolos. They're not big bad bosses. That kind of bums me out. All right, so um, LR, Demon King Piccolo. It could be anything, even tech, honestly. Stupid mouse. It could be any one of these. Since we're going to say Carnival Kid Goku is tech, let's make uh, Demon King Piccolo STR. I don't know. Nah, we already have an STR. Uh, make it AGL. AGL Demon King Piccolo. That'll be part one. And then going into part two, we would maybe have that that movie heroes EZA with the Goku and Piccolo unit from the Dead Zone movie. Got it right this time. Dead Zone. Movie heroes. Uh, LR. This one right here. We'll say that this is the EZA for part one or maybe part two, whatever. Like, you know, it'll be there somewhere. And then going into part two, it could either be another world tournament. Piccolo Goku. I would prefer not. I would instead like it to be something more in maybe saiyan saga would actually which actually would kind of work it kind of still works when it comes to what this has been all throughout right the, the thing flying through the sky could either be a nimbus or maybe it's a saiyan pod maybe it's both and then this right here might have been the shenron wish for demon king piccolo to get immortal uh, immortality and then i don't know you know something else here maybe this is Maybe this is Goku flying through the sky and Piccolo's flying with him. I don't know. And then maybe they're like fighting Raditz. And then maybe that physical Goku Piccolo unit can also receive an EZA. That'd be pretty cool. So then for part two, we'll say, we'll say Goku exchange into Piccolo. And then the carnival can be Raditz. That would actually be pretty neat. This is my opinion. All right. I know a lot of you are going to disagree with that, but... Putting Raditz in a Dokkan Fest, in, in a worldwide download celebration, I think for some people might be an absolute blasphemy, but for me, I think that would be cool. Because y'all know my philosophy. I want every character to get their own awesome representative. And I think having a carnival Raditz would be a step in the right direction. We don't need to do another Dokkan Festival because I know that the last time we had a Dokkan Festival Raditz, it rustled a few feathers. So maybe that's not going to happen. But a carnival one, I think is okay. Because most people, not most people, but some people will probably not even summon. So it's not like it's going to harm you all that much. So that is my mini speculation for Saiyan Saga. Let me know if there's anything else that you would want to add to that celebration. I don't want to spend too much time here because frankly, we got nothing. I will say one more thing. When looking back to last year, I think last year was better. Part one of the hints, in terms of the hints, I'm saying. Part one, we got this little toilet seat, right? But with this one, a lot of people were already starting to think, time machine because of this wing right here so time machine was already circulating in the atmosphere people were discussing people were thinking then the second one came along and they kind of came at this from a different direction because they started with the dokkan battle thing and then we got this you know this this cookie with some with some frosting on it uh and then we had uh the clouds here still didn't give anything away right people were thinking 
maybe it was the the base for a diorama but it wasn't confirmed because they were coming at it from a completely different perspective then we got this this on the third hint is where things came together this is where the time machine theory started to take shape crystallize people then were like okay it's it's the time machine we get it now i think this honestly was like the nail in the coffin and then for the fourth one i mean everything is just coming together at this point so there's not much there's not much room for discussion right you can't possibly negotiate your way out of that so this was cool I, I'm, I'm not i'm not so hot on this one the only thing that i care about is that i'm pretty sure this is pasadena and i'm pretty sure i've been here but i could be making this up pretty sure that's capital one that is so capital one it said dude the o is right there this is what i care about lr capital one is what we got coming up bro this is pasadena this is like old town pasadena where are my socal uh tunes at y'all know what i'm talking about right like this is definitely pasadena right all right i'm done guys thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed the video be sure to like down below Let in the comments your thoughts on the new hint does it help or hurt your particular case is it more so broly is it less so broly now is it more so dragon ball or maybe all of this is just a nothing burger and it was just a worldwide unification announcement promo thing all along it's dokkan after all they have been known to do the most illogical thing that you are not expecting so it is totally possible that it could be that but let me know your thoughts your theories give me some more ideas for the celebration in the comments down below also be sure to subscribe for more dope content in the future and click the notification bell so that you that you should be able to see where i'm thanks again stay tuned and our to dokkan responsibly